First of all, great to see you all. Great to see you, man. How you doing? Good, brother. How you doing? Ah, oh, man, I'm just I'm live I'm loving life. And when we get to talk about Top Gun, and that's my first question. In fact, I'm going to start with you. You're in the new Top Gun movie. Yeah. You're getting this question too, and so are you, Bob. <laughs> uh, you're in. Uh, people watching this right now, you'll know what you do when you see it. You're in the new Top Gun movie. Yeah. I mean, I'm getting chills, and I'm just watching and talking to you, wonderful people. But you're in it. Dude, that's pretty cool. It's insane, man. It's this mind-blowing thing. Like, I still don't think, like, it's still every single day I wake up and I'm like, oh, yeah, I did that. Like, I, I flew in a movie. I worked with Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise has my phone number and I have his. It's crazy. It's just <laughs> such a wild thing. The whole experience is wild, you know, to know that, like, Tom waited all this time to make this movie because he wanted the right story and the right script and the right technology. Like, and then as an Air Force kid who grew up around jets my entire life to come, you know, fast forward years later and be able to be a part of a film that means so much to the aviation community. Like it is, I'm a kid in the candy store, man, and I'm eating all the candy. It's <laughs> like just grabbing it off the shelves. Just I'm just happy to see, like I saw y'all on the screen. I'm just smiling wide. I'm just so proud. Seriously. All right, your wow moment. What was it? When did it dawn on you? When did you realize, all right, this is the Top Gun movie that we've been waiting for. It's happening. I mean, there have been so many moments and a lot of moments too where I'm like, ha has this landed on me yet? Like, am I... Do I, can I even fathom how exciting this is? Like, has it hit me yet? No. While we're making it, I'm like, is this, is this real life? Um, there, I think, I think probably the most emotional moment was, uh, we, we got to see the film during the pandemic. We all had to sit, I think we were all actually in the same row, mm -hmm. like four seats apart, spaced out. Um, and, and the lights go down and um, that, that beginning music plays Damn. and those opening credits and just full goosebumps yeah. every time. Though, first of all, the song is incredible and the way it builds is amazing. Um, but just like to see our names up there and to like see each other, you know, like our now great friends' names up there and to get to be a part of it was just like, I don't know. I mean, there, nothing beats that. Jerry was talking about your producer, Jerry Brookheimer. Everybody knows who Jerry Brookheimer is. I say it like, hey, this guy we just met. But he, he goes, he goes, uh, I said, he, he goes, yeah, when you hear Danger Zone, and I told people going in, uh, I was like, if I hear that, I'm going to scream and I will be the last one. <laughs> and of course, my arms go up. It's just chills. Yeah. All right, my man. Actually, that's a, I'm going to give you a different question. How many times did you play Danger Zone going to set to get ready to film? <laughs> Honestly, I, I have a feeling you, you, would, you would do that. I, uh, that's, I did that. <laughs> I did that, man. I do know. I, I just, Every morning he wakes up, play. I mean, okay. <laughs> can I tell you a funny story? On the flight over from Houston, and again, I was watching and just talking, doing interviews. I'm playing it in my headset on loop. Yeah. People on, on the row are like, and I'm going, da 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 da. And you know, the, the annoying person with the headset, and you know that when they're singing along, that yeah. was me. Yeah. But does that. It's a perfect song. It's a perfect song for any occasion to get you feeling like you can do anything. <laughs> That's true. And when you were there, though, and you're filming the blood, the adrenaline, pinch yourself moments, could you. Did, did it. My dude, there has never been more adrenaline rushing through my body in my whole life. Um, it was it's just crazy. I mean, but so that's why I think we're, we kind of miss it. We, we, we yeah. miss it a lot because it's just like a total high up there. I mean, I really miss the morning rides in the van with you singing Danger Zone. You do? Yeah. yeah. I miss you sitting in the back of the van like. Yeah. Just kind of whispering. <laughs> I have been trying to get people to sing that song, and I knew seeing you again, I was like, maybe, thank you for that, because I've been day, trying man. to get Danger Zone from somebody singing. <laughs> you know I got you, come on, man. I know you do, I know you do. All right, uh, show of hands, uh, how many people, it's an easy one, how many people, uh, how, many, how many of y'all went back, watched the original, and just... Just to get ready, just show of hands. That's oh yeah. And if you have a times. comment you want to add about that, the original played. You guys remember we were playing on, on the, the Roosevelt? Yeah, when we were on the Roosevelt, we were on the carrier. It played we were like, uh, while we were here. So technically, they were getting a satellite feed. It was on CMT, I think. CMT. Yeah. Yeah. They were getting a satellite feed, and it was on CMT randomly the day that we got on the boat to go out yeah, to, right. to to film. Yeah. Yeah, and, and I think we were in. Footloose, and we all made fun of Miles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's right. Awesome. I mean, he's incredible.